When the fresh waterman sees the waving of the reeds and sedges, he knows a Roger's blast may hurl himself and his craft to the bottom, said Robert Forby in his book, A Vocabulary of East Anglia. First published in 1825, it was an attempt to record the vulgar tongues of Norfolk and Suffolk in the first 20 years of the 1800s. In 1877, Sir Walter Rye, famed British athlete and antiquary, who wrote over 80 works on Norfolk, spoke of strange whirlwinds called Roger's Blasts, which he said were more common in Wood Baswick, Horning, Wroxham and South Walsham, which all happened to be on the Norfolk Broads. Today, these Roger's Blasts are more commonly known as Dust Devils. They are whirlwinds that spiral up from hot ground over water, which is why they were more commonly found on the broads. Whistling up wind is a more common form of weather magic, and it has been practiced for hundreds of years. It can either be used to whistle up a little breeze or a huge storm. It was said that some people would have literally been able to whistle for the wind, whereas some would have had to make a wind whistle out of alder or willow wood. The storms whipped up by Old Roger, a folklore name for the devil, will have said to have been whipped up by a flute of this kind. In a letter to the EDP in 1946, an E.A. Ellis spoke of a sudden whirlwind or Roger's blast that had felled 30 trees in Holt and asked if anyone knew the origin of the Norfolk name for this kind of strange weather phenomena, but also wondered if it might be connected to the old children's game with a rhyme about old Roger. The playground game involves words and actions of Old Roger, who is dead and gone to his grave, and an apple tree which is planted over his head. It also includes a line about an east wind blowing apples down from a tree and waking up Old Roger, and when an old woman goes to collect these apples, he gives her a large fright. However, this playground game was first referenced in 1876, long before the legend of Old Roger. This video was made as part of my DAV Skills Award. I've only got two more videos left. Learn more about my DAV Skills Award by clicking the first link in the description below. If you like videos about history or Norfolk folklore, consider subscribing. Bye.